suppose the Ulster Championship is so competitive, it's hard to say any game in the Ulster Championship is more important than the other game. But if you do win your first game, each, the next game will be more important and so on. Um, obviously, if you're not at your at your at your at your very very best, um, you're at the risk of being beaten the first round of the championship. Um, we'll we'll find that out none more so when we played on a goal last year, uh, two years ago, All Ireland champion. So we'll have to cope with that quite quickly and get get to the pace very very early on. Um, Donegal are very good when they're in front, and if we were to let them get ahead, we would find it very very difficult in that game. Um, so we can't look past that. No other team, I don't think, in the Ulster Championship is able to look past their first draw as well. So from that aspect, it'll be interesting to see how we get on. I think we've probably learned a lot from the league in terms of playing Dublin and playing Cork. That if you give a team a head start, it's very very difficult to get that caught back up again um, under the under the heat of the the battle and, and stuff like that. So I think we've learned that much, and we're looking forward to the twenty fifth of May. Derry's probably the farm team of the league. I know Dublin beat them in the league final, but they've been the, f the farm team, and uh, we know it's going to be a massive task to get into their home ground and beat them. But we're looking forward to it, and every man's putting in a hundred percent, and we feel we'll be well prepared for it, and just. Uh, we hopefully we can come out on the right side of that day in Celtic Park. I think if you look at there now, there's about six or seven teams that could win Ulster in a year. So that's the thing, and you could we could come out on top against and Derry, and then we could end up losing the next round. So that's the main one. We just take one game at a time, and you turn your focus to whoever you're playing next. And that for us now, it's Derry, and we're we're really looking forward, especially with Brian McGaver and that and charge them. And so we're looking forward to it. I think the people can expect um, Derry to be stronger in this year's championship than they have been the last few years. Um, I think they can expect the team to play really well together and to gel really well and to, to battle ferociously hard and to play well, quite a quite a good style of football and to play open and attractive by and large. Um, but I think defensively we're probably better now than we have been as well. So I think you'll see more of what you've seen in the league um, and hopefully even better quality than what, than what we had showed in the league as well. So... Um, we're expecting we're expecting real big performances from Derry this year. Personally, I'd love to get another also title. It's so hard to win. It's probably the most competitive province, and uh, every team wants to win another title because, as I said earlier on, anyone can. It's not the same teams won it every year like we won it before. Before and Monaghan won it last year, so Monaghan's up there now, and everyone wants to knock them off their perch, and that's the main one.